Hey, how's it going? So, I'm currently making another series where I get all the Creation Club mods from level one. However, I saw a new mod come up on a social media feed and I thought I'd do a quick video on this. It's a brand new major tome by Eleonora. It's been created by using only vanilla assets and it's a medium sized player home and was created specifically as a major's home in Winterhold. It can be used on PS4, Xbox One, and PC. So let's have a look at some pretty shots and then we'll take a walk around. Okay, it can be found just outside Winterhold. You have to discover it before you get a fast travel point. But it literally is just outside the town. And coming inside, you can see it's absolutely full of stuff. It's all static, uh, plenty of mannequins. You have all the enchantment you need. You have uh, obviously alchemy, enchanting. You'll have a chant, um, a chant, a staff enchanter. And you want to take this ancient crown. I'll explain that a little bit later. Everything's a static here, though you can collect these gleam blossoms eventually. Some of the hitboxes on these are quite tight. You've got a spider imbuing chamber, which is, I did a video on spiders and not many people use them. You should, they're great. Great parts of, uh, or really useful part of the game. Okay, and you've got um, some unenchanted staffs here as well. Brilliant way of increasing your enchanting, by the way, using a staff enchanter. Okay. And if we pop down, the whole thing's on three levels. Uh, the first level is your crafting area. Uh, in the basement area, you've got your smithing, you've got a smelter, anvil, workbench, uh, grinding wheel, the whole caboodle. And this is kind of handy. Nice little start for your smith in there. And yeah, that's the uh, first and second floors done pretty much. There you go. And go to the second floor, we've got your Bedroom come, kitchen come, garden. So have a wander around and we got some uh, planters. And some nice pots, actually I really like that, really nicely done. Got the Shrine to Julianus, as you'd expect in a Major's home. Plenty of uh, name storage here as well, loads of it. And you've got a, a dwarven bed. Not convinced about the bed. Uh, it, you do get the full well rested bonus. And coming around to the kitchen area. You've got your cooking pot, uh, lots of storage, and obviously you've got your oven and 
If you haven't seen it already, I did a video on cooking in Skyrim. It is better than you think. Something that a lot of people, again, uh, don't think about using. And you come into a bath. Actually, it's a lovely looking little bath hat. Doesn't auto strip you uh, at all. Like I said, it is purely done on uh, vanilla assets. So, still kind of cool. And right, so now I mentioned about the ancient crown. If you put that on, now this only works inside the building, it doesn't take you there if you're outside. And you come into your trophy hall. I haven't double checked everything, but I think it covers pretty much nearly all the unique items in the uh, vanilla game, uh, including the uh, DLCs as well. Yeah, it's pretty big. So yeah, that's pretty much it. Um, I think you can pretty much carry every single thing you, uh, or sorry, uh, display every single thing you get in the game, as far as I can see. And that's uh, pretty much the uh, the whole house. So uh, it's about time we uh, pop out, and I'll give my thoughts on this mod. Okay, so all in all, it's a very decent player home. However, it does have some pretty major flaws. I had to turn the sound down for the sake of the video, but the wind is constantly howling through the house. Uh, your followers do come in, but because the area you can actually move in is so small, they will always be getting in your way. So you're kind of forced to leave them outside. So really only recommend this if you play without followers now personally I would rather go for the scholars refuge or if you use creation club mirror watch now mirror watch obviously isn't in this location scholars refuge is um, both of which are better all round in my opinion however this does offer quite a lot in terms of storage and crafting now the one thing I have to mention is a view outside which is absolutely stunning. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed the video. Catch you later. Love you.